they totally are. It's been all about their guards, and I think you have to look at Bryce McGowan's Alonzo Verge, and even Derek Walker, who's not a guard, but has been able to drive the bat. You mentioned he's the co-Big Ten Player of the Week. First Husker to win that award in four years. Good action there. Julian Roper late. Understanding that defense not quite there. He able to cut that thing right to the rim. Roper lines up another one, and there's the first three-pointer for Northwestern. Barry, baseline, kicks up top on Dees, right in rhythm. That was so good by Ty. Setting a back screen, slip out of it. He's got his own pin down coming right for him. Here's Trey McGowan's down the lane, up with a left hand and in for McGowan. Remember, Trey McGowan's ejected against Wisconsin after the flagrant two foul on Johnny Davis that sent him out of the game. What a slip. And Andre lays it in with ease. He leads him with six points, three rebounds. He also has three assists. McGowan's looked like he may have gotten pushed. Man, athletic putback, and then, oh, man, had Nance fall on his head. Just a lazy pass from Greer, but a heck of an effort, effort from Derek Walker. Walker slips to the rim, lays it in, and he is fouled. And Nebraska, the hottest team in the Big Ten, and it's continuing here on opening night and ending. It's been the other guys, Walker with nine, Verge with seven, Mayan with six. Barron lost it going up. The defense of Walker, here's a three on two. What a pass. And McGowan's up and in, and a foul as well. Verge is just going to go to work right down the lane. He did it all himself. And Northwestern won't get another shot off. And Nebraska takes a 14-point lead into intermission. Certainly improved their effort, but they're going to have to contain the bounce, too. And that's locking in on the defensive end, not just with your effort, but also from a mental standpoint. Good things are happening, but Pete Nance touches the basket. Well, we talked about Barron being an X-Factor. is another one, Rob. He can be hot and cold. And so can this guy, Bowie. Nice little leader. Good strike to the second half for Northwest. Nance, NBA range. Yeah, well, his pops and his brother know about the NBA. He may be next. But now in his second and final season with Nebraska. Backdoor, Roper, extra pass, Williams. What a sequence for Northwest. On the baseline, up and under for Ty ben. Williams with a full head of steam. Roper inside, finger roll, yes, blocking foul, count it. I like the fact that Northwestern went 3-2 zone on that last play. It took Nebraska out of what they wanted to do, kept those guards out of the pain and really stagnated their offense. What a pass, though. Once again, you've got multiple bodies on Alonzo Verge. He kicks it out to Kobe Webster, but the zone has really been effective and making Nebraska very stagnant. Well, welcome to the party, Elijah Williams. The assist, and now the beautiful spin. Williams trying to take Andre. Nice kick. There's Boo. Booey got it, and we have a one-point game. Timeout, Nebraska. Over the top pass, Young catches, Young scores it. He still has just four points. He averages 17, bad turnover by Audige. Verge taking it right at Barry, blocking foul, bucket count. Roper, the freshman. Young offensive rebound and puts it back. Give all the credit to Chris Collins for dialing that one up out of the timeout. And Bowie knocks down a three, and Northwestern has their first lead since six minutes into this game. With the way Northwestern handled the business against Minnesota and the way that Nebraska has played over the last three, it's no surprise that this one is right down to the wire. Inside Young, patient, score it, foul on Walker. Chris Collins has been on his guys in the shot clock here to drive the basketball. We'll see if they do that right here. Bowie, now he's going to take a three, and he's going to knock it down. Everything changed when, when that 3-2 zone came into play. It's changed their mentality from getting guys the ability to go downhill. Now Bryce McGowan, that's a heck of a drive. McGowan's, three seconds, he drives, no whistle. 
The ball hits the deck and it's over. Northwestern escapes. 71-69 and they march on to the second round of the Big Ten Tournament. Oh, <laughs>